Well, DC, this is a true mixed martial artist of the highest order. You've watched the film. Hard for me to see much in terms of glaring weaknesses, and he believes he can react to anything that is thrown his way inside that office. It's unbelievable because whenever you're trying to prepare for someone, you look for weaknesses. But when you watch this guy, you, nothing jumps off the page. When you think I have to go wrestle him, you realize very quickly that not only can he defend takedowns, he can also go and secure them sure. himself. He's that new breed of fighter that has been doing every discipline from the very start of his career. You know you're looking at a guy that will contend for a championship. And if our fighter meeting on Thursday is any indication, confidence, not an issue for this young man coming in here tonight. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Brown is eight years his senior. He is five inches taller. He will have a three-inch reach advantage. All right, now to get us started, here's Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey! It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 26 wins, 19 losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Denver, Colorado, USA, Matt the Immortal! No! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce. The Dragon Lee! Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. They touch him up and we are underway. martial arts they can do everything when they're locked inside of the octagon i'm so excited to watch the highest level of mma on display tonight just misses there with the left well perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there nice kick landed by this gentleman oh and he caught the kick nice leg kick Talk to us about that strike. They suck so bad, especially when you're going to walk full speed to a knee to the body. It could in the night. Just out of range with that left hook. Nice 
nice punch lands over the top. Just out of range with that right hand. Kick to the body by Brown. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. And he landed the right hand there. That could have been lights out. Dealing with a cut now over that right eye. Well, a lot of people think he might have the best jab in this division, certainly using it effectively here. Oh! Game of inches right Damn there, it. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Well-placed kick there by Lee. Oh, left hook to the head is blocked. Big ball punch man. Now he gets back to range. And both guys really throwing with authority. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Can't take many of those. You better check. Back to the overhand left. No good. Head kick attempt, that one is blocked. Oh, nice job by the longer, taller fighter to land a flush knee to the head. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Head kick. Oh, tag him with that right hand. What a strike that was. What a strike that he's landing over and over again. His opponent will need to make some adjustments. Hands high, hands high. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Just missed with that right hand. He is all about that left kick to the body. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Big leg kick land. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Oh, that straight punch is gonna be a real problem if they can't make the adjustment. A real problem. He needs to move his head defensively if he's gonna avoid getting hit so many times in the face. And he lands the knee to the body now. Big punch land. Ooh, nice. Man, DC, his hands look good. A lot of volume, a lot of accuracy tonight. He's doing a great job being accurate, but he's also very fast. Look at the hand speed. Right. Well, a lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him tonight. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Brown's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. 
right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about a jab, jab, right hand? Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Real nice body kick lands. Effective punch there by Lee. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Check the high kick. Well placed kick there by Lee. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Lee. All right, let's go. Let's get those hands going now. Come on. Straight punch lands. Nice combination of jabs. Right punches there. Oh, beautiful job by him there. Maybe the opponent was expecting the straight punch, and he goes to the hook. Mike Tyson used to have some of the best hooks in boxing, and this young man tonight is throwing him with that type of intensity. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Nice kick. Now connects with a right. Oh, man, that cut is getting worse. Absolutely nasty. Strong kick to the outside of that lead leg for him there. You do not want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. He does not wind up on that kick, but he somehow is managing to land it with so much force. Doing a really good job of throwing those leg kicks. Sneaky head kick. That was stuck in. Nice strike. All right, so he continues to land that patented jab and keeping his opponent at bay. You can know that it's coming, but until you're in there with the, the speed and the power of that jab is something you can't really prepare for. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. How good is that right hand? Effective punch there by Lee. Over and over, he landed a big body kick. And they separate. Ooh, head kick landed. Hurt. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Back and forth we go here! He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Kick to the body by Lee. Man, look at the redness now almost immediately on the right side of his body. with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Well, he's got a pretty good side kick, and you saw it right there. He did it great, and it pushed his opponent back. Notice how it creates space and allows him to get back to where he's coming from. Lunges forward with a left there. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Brown. And he caught the kick. Let's see what he can do with it. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, 
He's really trying to damage his opponent. And as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round. And at some point, these are going to really start to take their toll. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick. And watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Well, the leg kicks have been a big storyline in this one, and there's another one. So he continues to slow his opponent down. And nice poker face on the other side. I'm not sure how many more he can take. He won't be able to take many more. Think about Edson Barbosa, how he lands those beautiful leg kicks, no wind up so fast. Eventually, guys get stopped from taking too many. This seems to be the path that he is wanting to take tonight in this fight. And there comes the separation now. Brown gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Oh, big punch land. Liver kick. Back and forth we go. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Huge block there. Just missed with the left there. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. That is a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed upright. I mean, when you can hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, straight right. Oh, big left. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Try to establish that jab. Good stick. Oh! Oh! oh, oh, oh this fight's gonna be over. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very bad. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Browns all sorts of bruised up on his body. That is gonna hurt something fierce tomorrow. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. So he lands another strike here to his opponent's liver. The defense has got to do something at this point in time. He was buckled with a similar shot earlier in the fight. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Nice punch there by Lee. Just missed with the straight left hand. What a tricky head kick. Throws the right hand there. Big kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Nice head kick. Nice punch lands over the top. with a right hand. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Brown. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, head kick blocked, though, by Brown. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. He loaded up there on that high kick. on the front kick there. 15 seconds. Brown 
gets hit by that kick to the body. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Nice loop of punch. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. Watch the shot. Big leg kick land. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. Well, you got to think he's going to enjoy watching this one back tomorrow morning. He has landed a ton of significant strikes. And really, a guy who has been a monster in the gym finally putting it together here. Go home and admire your work. It doesn't take till the next morning. He's going back to me right now and firing up the video to look at beauty in action. And he was the one who caused all the action. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Nice. Way to hide that leg kick. Just over three minutes to go. that knee to connect to the body, and if you're the defensive fighter here, you got to make sure you don't eat too many more of you those. You cannot eat too many. you got to be the other side. Otherwise, land one, that's going to shut everything down. Got clip with the right hand. Brown's lower jaw is just nasty at this point. Really swollen in that area now. Uppercut attempt nearly connects, but no good. Whiffs on the straight right hand. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Oh, good job defensively to block the strike there by Lee. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Just over two minutes to go in the round. Right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe still standing after taking that punch. Caught that. Now there's danger in that too because when you start reaching on to catch that kick, you come the high kick and then you're in a lot of trouble. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. There's no tell on that leg kick. Nice strike. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Lee. Oh, slips to avoid the right. Oh, nice job by him to get the knee to the target there, using his length exceptionally well tonight. Brown gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Well, that nose isn't going to be able to take too many more as he doubles up on the jab there. So good to watch the male fall and watch guys now fight behind the jab. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. 
Oh, nice right hand. That was a thudding leg kick. Oh, big shot land. Oh, flush knee to the body. He's got the length advantage in this fight and certainly made it count in that exchange. Real quick leg kick. Oh, tags him with the left. That is an educated left hand. Educated left hand. He's throwing it so fast. So crisp. Oh, he heard a belly jab. Nice leg kick land. All right, let us get you some highlights from that previous round, DC. And how about just the, the sheer volume of head kicks for him? I don't know why this dude's energy bar isn't completely zapped. You can't throw that many head kicks over the course of a fight. But I guess if you're landing them, you might as well keep going. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. That was some serious precision striking on display in the previous round. Found his openings upstairs and closed the show. He has landed at an alarming rate. His opponent needs to get his head off the center line. He's walking into him with his head straight up, not moving, trying to engage without changing the angles. That is why he is getting brutalized right now. Good punch, Lance. Oh, high-level defense there. The hook shot is blocked by Brown. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Big kick, Lance. Oh, good kicks. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Working out of that southpaw stance. Oh, setting up the left hook, but at a range. Beautiful punch. Leg kicks. Oh, look at the redness underneath that left elbow. He is badgering that left side of the body. That was lightning fast, that right hand. Big body kick lands. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. Nice kick. Punch coming, it's blocked. It's broken, I think. Under three minutes now to go in the fight. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh, he might be out. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Kick there by Brown. Connects with the right hand. Pretty good punch that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Ooh, what a head kick. Lands flush with that right hand. And now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high. And now he's got him hurt bad. Nice punch, Lance. Under two minutes now to go in the fight. You really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Lands the right hand. How about that shin? Lee going for the head kick. No dice. All right, well, time is the enemy now, DC, and he's really running out of it if he's going to get his hand raised tonight. He's got to move forward. He's got to do everything 
punch at his opponent to try and find that punch or that kick that's going to end the fight. There is no time for strategy. Oh, there's the head kick. It's blocked. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Whoa, whoa. From the start, how's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Brown gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Thirty seconds now to go in the round. Beautifully timed and place kick there by Brown. Fifteen seconds. That shot blocked by Brown. Big head kick land. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. What else can you say but what a fight? All right, so a lot to like over the distance of that fight tonight. Clearly, we think we saw one guy win the fight and largely got it done with the striking. Yeah, he got it done with the striking. And that's exactly what he's known for. He's known as a guy that's so comfortable whenever he's in the stand-up. And that showed tonight as he truly outworked his opponent. decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 54-5. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, so the judges are in agreement tonight. He is your winner by unanimous decision. Certainly pretty easy fight to score, I thought. Yeah, I thought it was an easy fight to score. Whereas his opponent had a few moments, he was the one that truly did